The 10th Nationwide Congress of the Lao Front for National Construction, or LFNC, convened on Wednesday, the 8th of January in Vientiane capital, with the participation of 461 full party members, who will represent members across the country. It is believed that the Lao Front dedicated to national solidarity. The 10th National Wide Congress of the Lao Front for National Construction, or LFNC, convenes with the participation by Party Secretary General and President of Laos, Comrade Bunyang Burajit, Politburo Member and Prime Minister of Laos, Tonglun Sisulit, Politburo Members, Comrade Bani Yatotu, also former Party Secretary General and President of Laos, Jumali Sayason, as well as more than 460 honorable guests from central and local organizations nationwide are also taking part in the meeting. In his remark, former LFNC President Pandung Jit Vong Sa said, National solidarity is the main factor contributing to political stability, social order, and stable economic growth in Laos. His report also summarizes all factors and situations that impact the front's strategic missions as well as national socioeconomic development. It also highlights the front's leading role over the past year in educating people of all ethnic groups, social classes, religions, sexes, and ages on the need for solidarity. According to him, one of the LFNC's outstanding achievements over the past year was the mobilization of people from all sectors of Lao society, including people of Lao descent living abroad, to participate in national development and poverty reduction. Acting President of the Lao Front for National Construction, Kam Bai Damlat, reminded those present of the LNFC's responsibility to help maintain political stability and protect the environment as well as Lao culture and customs. He called on the LNFCs to continue to disseminate party directions and government policies and regulations as well as the decision to the party central committee as well as the decision of the party central committee to build provinces as strategic units, districts as budgeting units, and villages as development units.